اعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم يا ايها الذين امنوا كتب عليكم الصيام كتب عليكم الصيام كما كتب على الذين من قبلكم لعلكم تتقون Brothers and sisters in Islam, Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. We thank Allah the Almighty for his blessings that are innumerable and I thank you also for active listening at this blessed time. I greet you with the greetings of Islam. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. As promised that inshallah we will be coming today to share with you few points pertaining to Ramadan. Of course, I did start with the recitation of the ayah revealed pertaining to this great month. Allah said, O you who believe, fasting is prescribed unto you, fasting is prescribed for you as it was prescribed for those before you so that you may attain piety. For this reason, brothers and sisters in Islam, Ramadan is here in 12 days. Ramadan, the month of the Quran. Ramadan, the month of self-discipline. Ramadan, so that all of us can work together as a team in order to improve ourselves. Well, quickly, let's look at a few things. Inshallah, this year, Ramadan at ICCD, we surely, by the will of Allah, will be having Taraweh, nightly supererogatory prayer, and uh, our imams are ready, inshallah. Now remember, we invite all of you to come. However, there will be social distancing. If you are here without hand sanitizer, without mask, see our custodian Ayman, and surely he will provide you with one. But let's do whatever we can to use this occasion in order to spiritualize ourselves. But remember, as ICCD will try to do, this year again, we will try as much as possible and complete the recitation or complete the entire Quran, inshallah. A very important subject also that I would like to share with you, and that is vaccination during the month of Ramadan. Remember, most of our scholarship here in the United States and our institutions, I said most, have agreed that vaccination is necessary in order to protect our lives. Yes, Allah is the cure. Allah heals. But indeed, Tadaw, the Prophet Sallallahu said, so ours is that during the month of Ramadan, we encourage you, if it is your turn to be vaccinated, get it. Now the question is, am I or is my fasting going to be invalid? Pertaining to vaccination or pertaining to injections in the month of Ramadan, our scholarship have disagreement pertaining to that. However, Sheikh al-Islam Ibn Taymiyyah did mention that هذا مما تنازع فيه because of the clear-cut textual evidence pertaining to actually injections, our scholars have disagreement. But injections that are nutritive or nutritional, surely that majority of our scholarship are of the view, if not all of them, that indeed that will invalidate one's fast. But vaccination, COVID-19 vaccination will not affect your fasting. You may hear it from other scholars or others who would say that it may invalidate one's fasting, but I'm saying that there is disagreement pertaining to this subject. Ours is to always do that which is right. Brothers and sisters in Islam, congratulations, Ramadan Mubarak, we surely will do whatever we can to do it together in order also to achieve the blessings of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Again, to you all, I greet 
Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. But before that, remember, go to our webpage, ICCD, and get more information. And I believe our first night of Taraweeh prayer is going to be, inshallah, on Monday, the 12th of April. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.